In the heart of a nation, a conflict is brewing. A staggering 25 Republican governors are rallying behind Texas Governor Greg Abbott in a high-stakes border feud. This isn't just a simple disagreement, folks. They're defying the Supreme Court of the United States. The chronicle of events unfurls like a political thriller. It all started when Governor Abbott, leading the second largest state in the union, decided to take a stand on the border issue. His perspective? A more stringent approach to border security. Now, this wasn't just a lone wolf howling into the wind. 24 other GOP governors echoed his sentiments, standing tall with Abbott. As the tension escalated, the situation caught the attention of the Supreme Court, the highest court in the land, the final arbiter of the law. In a 5-4 decision, the court temporarily permitted federal officials to cut razor wire barriers set up by the Texas government, which had prevented U.S. Border Patrol agents from entering an area where immigrants sometimes cross into the United States. This decision, moreover, came in one of several disputes between Texas and the United States over border policy, with many GOP-led states now backing Abbott. Under existing law, it is well established that the federal government is in charge of nearly all questions of immigration policy and may override state immigration policies that conflict with its goals. As the Supreme Court said in Arizona v. United States 2012, it is fundamental that foreign countries concerned about the status, safety, and security of their nationals in the United States must be able to confer and communicate on the subject with one national sovereign, not the 50 separate states. The GOP governors, instead of stepping back, held their ground. But it is unclear whether the current Supreme Court, with its 6-3 Republican supermajority, will honor this long-standing balance of power between the national government and the states, which has been in place at least as far back as the court's 1941 decision in Heinz v. Davidowitz. Though the court's Monday order in Department of Homeland Security v. Texas was a victory for the Biden administration, it was also an ominous sign that many of the justices are eager to shift power away from the federal government and towards state officials like Abbott, who are eager to impose more enforcement policies. In summary, what we're seeing is a multi-layered conflict. Texas Governor Greg Abbott, backed by 24 other GOP governors, is in a border feud that has escalated to defy a Scottish ruling. This act of defiance is inciting nationwide discussion about state rights and the respect for our legal system. This story is far from over. The actions of these governors will undoubtedly echo in the halls of our nation's history for better or worse. Like, share, and subscribe. Gamer Gazette would like to say thank you and welcome to all new subscribers. Remember, we're all gamers.